yo it's your boy new way we're here for another video on the channel we're actually going to be watching episode 15 of some eminence and eminence has been going pretty well because in the last episode we actually wrapped up the whole little um sanctuary situation with uh, the archbishop and um how he seen the cult of the diablos but yeah man sid popped off at the end against uh i think oh her name was olive oliviera oliviera yeah something like that but uh, it was just crazy, man. We just had another atomic situation. I didn't really expect. I, I'm assuming that's just like something that he normally like to do. And that's just something that's so crazy. So I really do um, see like a lot of y'all liking Eminence and enjoying it for what it is. And I do appreciate it because this is some a series that I've been doing for a minute now. I started it with Cowboy. And um, Cowboy is doing pretty decent for itself too. But I do, I have been enjoying Eminence for like one of these first time isekais for what i've been watching and like like i said it, when i first started i don't really watch isekais like that i don't um this is one of the first ones i really watched like through and through and i've been enjoying it sid has really kept me locked into it so i really hope y'all been as well so other than that uh we just gonna go ahead and jump into it and see what our boy doing all right 15 it's a good number the Bushin festival oh yeah they were talking about that Queen, I think her name, Princess Iris? Alexia and Iris. Yeah, they were talking about this last episode. Yeah, it's like some tournament. But she said Iris was going to join. <laughs> Dark Knights. Yeah, everybody happy for this tournament, ain't they? Even fighters from the East. This <laughs> decoy. Dang. We got witch doctors out here too. <laughs> Background extras. What's on the agenda today, Sid? Fighters, spectators. I hope y'all don't hear that car outside, but y'all most likely do. <laughs> this is what you must do, man. <laughs> Conceal my eminent powers, enter the tournament. Bro, <laughs> who the heck is that guy? Of course, he's got to think big, think big. What's the best type of moment I can have for myself, man? I don't know. <laughs> hey. <laughs> big wave. I hope, does anybody hear this, man? <laughs> All right. Strongest, weakest, man. Gamma. She's the one if you want to have somebody civilized, even though she's very clumsy. <laughs> hey. <laughs> what she got going on? <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> how, did, how did this start? We knew each other since kids. <laughs> nice. Disguise so. Of course, he tried to do the same thing at the little the goddess trial. <laughs> I hate him. <laughs> Who can you speak it with? You don't have no lieges. <laughs> like you don't got nobody else to tell. You got the numbers. <laughs> Who is your right hand? Call that wall. Wisdom of the Shadows. So it's just like some slime that's... <laughs> what is her name? Etta. Okay, there you go. I won't forget because I got to remember. Etta. I'm going to call her the slime. All right, then. <laughs> so face was you like. She's one of them type of people. She don't even walk. <laughs> he looks like mundane man Dark Knight he was disowned by his noble family five years ago unremarkable and unremarked death. so he's just a nobody <laughs> he looks like somebody I'm trying to remember exactly that's how you do it <laughs> some old type of technology the thing Mr. Krabs was riding on. <laughs> I 
Oh, there he goes. <laughs> he looks ill. <laughs> He'd be appropriate to use a bad posture. Of course he's able to do this. With his bones, bro. Gay imposter. <laughs> okay. The concept brilliantly. Okay. I gotta forget. I gotta remember it. the stuff that they know. She, he taught them. There she goes. <laughs> No athletic ability. She can't fight. None of that. <laughs> Alright. You gotta keep it pushing them. Who is this? That was... Let me not do that. Let me almost miss her name. Velgada 7 Blade. Anna Rose. An ancient warrior. Okay. So she's one of the seven blades and a rose? She's sort of sickly body. <laughs> Who are you? Thank you for your concern, ma'am. But you don't know who I am. I'm mundane. Exactly. But what about what I just said? <laughs> You just gotta be like this, man. <laughs> the eminence in shadow moves. Kid. Jesus, <laughs> she was doomed to lose. <laughs> Quentin. Some weak ass blanket. Bro, it always be these strong arm people that's trying to deal with something. He sore look cool, but. <laughs> that's classic, bro. <laughs> You laughing too? <laughs> Ride the big wave. <laughs> Bro, instigating back there. Oh, man. Dang. <laughs> to apologize. Third raid. <laughs> Just some random people. In this world is entirely unsafe. If I hope he is he about to kill him? <laughs> this right here. Just I can combo him. <laughs> For humans. <laughs> I was trying to actually win. <laughs> so he's not gonna do that. <laughs> he's gonna get bodied. At least try to fight back. <laughs> Damn, they going stupid on him too. On a low level street fight. Exactly. You ain't worth my time, bro. You just want him to just say he you got it. What'd that tell you? You don't want to fight her though. What'd that tell you? Why your friends ain't talking about that? They ain't, they ain't saying you ain't you you gonna let her step in like that, Quentin? <laughs> hmm. Suffering permanent damage. Well, you're not my friend then. <laughs> exactly. Bro, he just got stabbed the last episode. <laughs> I hate him, man. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Anna Rose, Nick, Shiana. Jimmy Nussan, and mundane man. And nobody's gonna just <laughs> catch it. Hmm? Huh? <laughs> Forgetting what body he in him. Ugly. <laughs> What girl? Oh, it's on my Anna Rose. <laughs> I 
Keep the best thing the minute ago. This toughest guy I've seen. He feeling it himself. Um, I think that's halfway. Yeah. I can I, I can kinda tell now when that happens. This is one that we haven't seen his friends in a minute. <laughs> Just reaching his climax. I hope he's not going to blow up this place like he does everything else in the world. <laughs> we need to collect that on earlier fight. Yeah, like you going to join. <laughs> Point oh, man. That guy's a total pushover. He's not even paying attention to him. He, he's not going to know that he's betting on him. And guess right the first time. Oh, yeah. She is in this. This is the picture they showed in season, I mean, episode three. A fair amount of buzz. So she's in this too. <laughs> like how you keep trying to ask for money, bro. <laughs> wow. Gladiatrix. <laughs> Souvenir. That's it. <laughs> You don't need them, right? Yeah. If you serious about your bets, three? A burger does sound good right now, you know? Bro, you would, this man's gonna think about how he's gonna win, not even what. <laughs> Play this in an outfit like that. Tuna King? This one's a, f <laughs> it's a McDonald's sandwich. Oh yeah, <laughs> look at Beta, bro. Guess your friends, yeah. That's how it be. A nice girl. <laughs> She's just a <the> mediator. <laughs> Awkward around each other. Alexia. Oh, yeah, okay. That'll be perfectly fine, bro. World peace is really important after all. <laughs> what you mean? Me to my fiance. Perv. <laughs> That's what she was talking about last episode. She's really nice. <laughs> Very observant. Just to fight all of them. She had something going on with her chest last episode too, didn't she? My father and everyone. She going through it right now, so let me know. <laughs> that man, <laughs> bulky guy. So that man said he really met so many people when he was a kid, bro. <laughs> Amazing. Selfish, the man. She's acting from the heart, man. Hmm? Good answer. He got to, right? Like, outside of just personality wise, she's the best girl. <laughs> he is a burger. Here's a burger, bit. <laughs> Everything's gonna work out with me. Don't worry. 
Riz their up. What the? <laughs> When I really think about it, man, that stuff is probably so hard. Plow potato field. And we just play safe bets. It's like sports betting right now. <laughs> Based on totals. Aww. Oh, I'm betting 10 matches at once. Sid did not be caring, bro. He be living for the moment. Who is this? Gilgamesh? Goldie Gilded, the unbeaten legend. Okay, I already know what type of person he is. <laughs> Hi! Ever victorious. Imagery not to not to lose this or something like that. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> so happy. It helps me win. Is that a he be dolly in his sword? <laughs> Have fun. Nobody. Just going. That I can get a general idea of Battle Strength. <laughs> you look. The one's balance of his muscles will tell you he's got it. He does not know what he's talking about. <laughs> It's not a bad figure. If it's low, he is just all for show, bro. <laughs> he looks like he couldn't fight his way. Inept. <laughs> so yeah, he doesn't know what he's talking about. <laughs> Unless Sid is just hiding it. 33. This is, that's ridiculous, bro. <laughs> Accurate analysis. People be like that in real life, though. Hmm? Huh? <laughs> Stand up, please. Well, anyways. Mundane man. Dang. Take it on the chin. Take it on the chin. <laughs> Professor Goldie. He is still going. Just to see got weak competitors. So it's vice versa. <laughs> you said 33, bro, four. Oh, we finna embarrass you, dog. <laughs> I don't even gotta know how you fight. I do. <laughs> well. <laughs> All your life savings. Sid's finna break his pockets, bro. <laughs> Might have not been a fluke. This man says be so like five steps ahead. He be trying to make sure he's in there for the moment. That's it. <laughs> Ugh, that's how it is. Boy, if you don't stop knocking on my door. Oh, 
<laughs> huh? Amazing. So she got kidnapped. Or she just gone. Stabbed her fiance. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. <laughs> How, when? When was this? This happened last night when we was just with each other, bro. <laughs> like, stabbed her fiance and ran off on the plug twice, bro. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Y'all are wild. No females are wild. <laughs> no, that's crazy. Because, it's... <laughs> man, that was a funny episode. Not really much happened. We just really, I guess, got an introduction to how Sid is going to be going into this Bushin tournament. So it's going to be a lot more. Um, I probably it's, it's going to pop off again probably soon. So, <laughs> but yeah, I can tell that this is one of these episodes for a lot of information that we have to learn and introduce to a lot of new characters. Perv as a, is like his name, I'm assuming, actually. Cra crazy, right? But um, we met Anna Rose, and we met Goldie Gildy, I guess his name was, and Monday Man for the Bushin Tournament and Festival. But there's apparently a lot of people in the festival from Alexia, Iris isn't, but everybody is here in the city, and it's kind of crazy. Like, you can just assume that things are going to get a lot more it's crazier this time around than it has been in the past few situations in this anime. And I, I can kind of sense it just due to the fact that it's a tournament. All tournament arcs are usually kind of crazy, like, to be honest with you. So, if I see Sid fight any of them people, because she's supposed to be in the tournament. Rose. And... Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. So, other than that... I just can't wait to see how it goes, but yeah, Sid showed up today on Pop Shop. He showed up today. <laughs> so other than that, that's going to be it for me. So hopefully y'all enjoyed it, but thank you all so much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe down below if you enjoyed the video. And make sure you follow my socials down below in the description if you want to know when another video comes out before it comes here on YouTube. But that's it for me today. So I will see you guys later, man. Y'all take care and have a great day. Peace.